local forecast with meteorologist Jackson Chastain starts now. All right, well, here in the midstate, we're just dealing with winds. Yeah, so far, but tomorrow could actually prove an interesting story. But for tonight, I think we should focus on the wind. Right now, steady at 20 miles per hour here at Middletown and Harrisburg International Airport. 37 degrees, so the temperature rapidly dropping from the mid to low 40s, where we were in the afternoon, upper 40s at points. Uh, with that being said, a very cold night ahead. And the wind obviously not helping because that makes things feel a lot colder than maybe it actually is. And these are steady winds. It doesn't even account for the gusts. We still have gusts upwards of 45. 55 miles per hour in places that wind advisory that the National Weather Service issued this morning still goes until about 9 p.m. tonight. So we still have a little bit of a ways to go before that expires and we're good to go after that. But even once that's gone, we get through the rest of the evening and you're still going to see winds of about 10 miles per hour. So it's going to remain a little bit breezy at least overnight and heading into your Sunday as temperatures drop below that freezing mark, which is going to be a key thing for tomorrow because what we're watching for tomorrow is uh, still a little bit more of the same. So breezy weather. This is off the back of a cold front that pushed its way on through earlier this morning and overnight last night, and it's bringing in this big rush of colder polar air. Uh, when you get a big, robust system like that, that's no surprise. But what we're going to see on Sunday, especially from basically about 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. is the opportunity for a few snow squalls, a line of snow showers with strong winds associated with them to move on through into the region. So I want everybody to be aware of that because uh, it's going to feel like a blizzard for at least a few hours once this squall passes on through the models. Uh, not really handling this all too well. This should be mostly snow when it passes on through, but we're expecting some snow squalls that will likely pass through the mid state around that lunchtime hour. It'll be a quick mover, so that's the good thing right there, and it's a relatively thin line, so it's not going to linger around too long, but while it's there, expect some heavier snowfall rates, blowing snow, that kind of thing. I don't want anybody to be taken, uh, taken aback by this, so uh, it'll move on out relatively soon into the early afternoon, and we'll be back to normal, but throughout the rest of the week, getting into temperatures that are in the 30s and into the 20s uh, next week, teens for those lows.